Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Danielle, AKA Stitcherista here on YouTube. And today is going to be an unboxing of a Dreamer Designs diamond painting kit. I have never owned a Dreamer Designs kit. This was given to me as a gift by one of my subscribers, Mary. So Mary, thank you so very much. I have to say I'm already a little impressed by the handle on the box. Do you guys like little stuff like that? When I saw that, I was like, get the hell out of here with that. Yeah. Okay, so the kit that I will be unboxing is Hazel. Absolutely love this image. The artwork is from Curtis Reykjavik. Reykjavik or Reykjavik. It is a 60 by 80 centimeter round diamonds. It has 53 colors with four AB diamonds. Wowza. And when I looked this up, so I looked it up on their website because I wanted to give you guys the proper details. It says this is a pro level kit with 76,800 diamonds. I said, okay now, 76,000 diamonds. So I have always said when anybody tells you Diamond painting is stupid or it's not intricate or complicated or I don't know if they try to discount it like it's, oh, that's something my kid would do. Yeah, show them that number. Just saying. Okay, so this kit on their site is $59.95. So let's open it up because like I said, I have never owned... A Dreamer Designs kit. So, I don't really know what to expect. So, here's how the box opens. I'm still loving the handle on the box. You guys have no idea. Okay. All right, there's goodies in here. Okay, at the top. Oh, God. The whole thing's in a big bag? Oh, it is. Oh man, I feel like I need superhuman strength to pull it out of the box. Wow. Okay, I have to say, further impressed by the bag. Because most companies just have a plastic bag. This is like, um, what's the word? It feels like it's fabric. It feels fabric-y, but it has the Dreamer Designs logo on it. Wait a minute. We're going to scoot this back a little bit. So I'm not reaching so far. So it has their logo on it, and the top has a drawstring. So here is the canvas, all wrapped with a pretty purple bow, because that seems to be their signature color. And then, ooh, this feels nice. It feels nice and velvety. I like that. So that's their toolkit. We will take a peek at that. And then here are the diamonds, which we will take a look at later. Okay. I'm loving the bag. I'm loving it so far. All right. So we're going to take a look at the toolkit first. It is tied very well with a nice little knot. Bear with me here. <laughs> okay. I'm loving the bag. All right. So, in their toolkit includes the normal things. Ooh, I like that their trays have their insignia on it. That's kind of cool. And I love these trays. Although this one's smaller. Let me see. No, it's not. I thought it was smaller than the ones that um, I, I'm using, but I definitely will save those. Two pots of wax, also with the Dreamer Designs logo on it. Now, I had a question on one of my other videos. Someone asked me, what's my favorite wax? Believe it or not, I've tried so many. While I love the Pretty Placer crayons, I actually really love the pink wax. I, I just do. I know I may be in the minority there, but... They also include a very large straightener and two multi-placers, which are awesome if you use those kinds of things. 
excess baggies, two diamond painting pens. Wow, look at that. One with a plastic tip, one with the metal tip. Two pencil grips, because trust me, when you're starting out, you don't need to get all the fancy pens and all that stuff. You don't. For the first, I want to say six months, I used just the regular pink pen that came in all the kits. And then a pair of tweezers, which also has their insignia on it. Yeah. Very impressive toolkit. I like it very much. Okay, now we're going to take a look at my favorite part, the canvas because yeah all right we're gonna set that stuff right there okay so i can already tell the canvas feels like a diamond dots canvas it is well made it's not as soft as um like a diamond art club but it um it reminds me of diamond dots for sure. Oh, wait a minute. There's presents in here. Okay. That were rolled up in there. Oh, get out of here. This was rolled on a foam roller. Impressive. You're impressing me, Don Dreamer Designs. Okay. So in there, when I unrolled it, there were instructions on how to diamond paint and also ways to get to their Facebook groups and stuff like that. And they also have included a sticker with the key. Like that very much because you can stick this on a piece of notebook paper, I cannot speak, on a piece of notebook paper and have this next to you. Okay, so I'm gonna try to unroll this the other way because I'm pretty sure that Dreamer Designs is um, poured glue. And I'm trying to unroll this, damn it, so it's not like all wrinkly. Okay. Holy shit, wait till you see this. Oh my God. I try not to cuss in my unboxings because I realize a lot of people watch these, but sometimes I can't help it. Okay, come on. It's, it's, it's being finicky. It doesn't want me to unroll it. Or it doesn't want me to... I'm trying to roll this. The... Okay. That's probably the best I'm going to get here. Oh my God, I love this image. Would this not look fantastic done at Halloween? Let me back you guys up so you can literally see the whole thing. Oh my God. Okay. So at the top, I'll hold it up here since I, it says the title, who the artist is and the design size up here in the right has all of their YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest. The key is in the top right and the bottom left. Oh my God, this makes me want to start this one. I love this before I even like look at the diamonds. I love the artwork. She's amazing. Look at her hair. Couldn't you just die? All right, so a clear cover, of course, which I always replace with release papers. Let's see how sticky the canvas is. Pretty sticky. Very, very sticky. And the symbols look nice and clear, from what I can tell. I usually do a light pad test, but I don't have like a spare light pad up here. I'm impressed so far, Dreamer Designs. Okay, let's take a look at the diamonds. So on the diamond pack, it has the name of the kit. I am loving that kit. That image, oh my God. Okay, I wanna see what the AB diamonds are. It's the four at the top. Okay. Let's go through the diamonds. I will never be able to get these back in there, so I'm gonna be rolling, just, just rolling them up in the canvas. Okay, so 
the way they package theirs, all of theirs have their logo on the bag. And then on the other side, here is the DMC number. So there's a lot of colors in this piece. There are 53. That's quite a bit. I'm looking for AB diamonds. Because we know what colors look like, right? I mean, there are some beautiful pinks and purples and greens. Three bags of black, which is not surprising. And that background looks purple up there, so I will enjoy that. Ooh, I see some AB diamonds. Ha -ha! Some more pinks and reds. Ooh, there's an AB diamond. So this one looks like white. Here's another one. This one is like a cream color. And then here's another one, green. So I'm guessing that these are probably in her hair, these two. Ha ha, yes. So there's one more AB diamond. Because there was four. And that was only three that I, yeah, that was only three. Ooh, I love the teal colors. Oh, I'm just so partial to teal. Two bags of 3371, which is like a dark chocolate brown. And the closest to black that you will have besides 939, which is like a dark, dark navy blue. And I know this from cross-stitching. Okay, let's flip this around. I love the bright light greens and purples and magentas. And there's a couple bags of 823, which is also a dark blue. Okay, where are you, AB? You gotta be in this pile, or unless I missed it. I don't see any AB diamonds in this. All right, I must have missed it. Let's take a peek. Yeah, it says there were four. Where is that section? No, here we go. So did I miss it? Yes, I did. I'm, oh, okay, so green like a yellowish cream, white, and then this pink one woo, is AB. So that's nice that they put all the AB diamonds like right there. And what I just realized, oh no, that's not it, Never mind. I thought they had them in, oh, they do. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so Dreamer Designs puts the bags in order according to the key. So if you see, this says 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. This is an order. So when you go to kit up, all you have to do is lay them in order and then cut them. And I love that. I absolutely love that. I have to say, I'm quite impressed by their kit. I've never diamond painted a Dreamer Designs, but... Maybe after Sweet Tooth, because I would love to have Sweet Tooth done. God, I've had so much left to do on that, but isn't this so gorgeous, though? Let's get in a little bit closer. Don't you just love it? Love it. I love the candy apple that's in her hair. And the drink and her hair. I love her hair. Her hair is my favorite part. Absolutely. So, okay, I will link... This kit down below in the description box. As always, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below and I will answer them to the best of my ability. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.